Hello, human. Thank you for being on the channel. You know what time it is. Michael Myers is back. Halloween H2O, 20 years later. Lori Strode is back in this. She cut her hair. Her hair is short. And I appreciate a woman that can rock short hair. Only certain women can pull off short hair. And I feel like Lori Strode is badass enough and attractive enough to pull off the short hair. And this time, she a little different. It's been 20 years. Michael Myers is alive and kicking. Seems like he's faster, stronger, smarter, like he hasn't aged a day. It's like he woke up on a Tuesday and he's like, oh, yeah, my sister is still out there. I got to kill me some Lori Strode. And Lori Strode is doing well for herself. She's a headmistress at this private school, which her son John attends, played by Josh Hartnett. We also have LL Cool J in this movie. He plays a security guard at this private school. I like LL Cool J. He's cool, man. He's a legend in so many different ways. If you don't know about, if you don't know nothing about LL Cool J, I don't know how to help you. But yeah, I really like his character Ronnie. I believe, if I'm not mistaken, is the name of the the character that LL Cool J plays in this movie. Really cool security guard, cool with uh, Lori Strode's son John, and Lori is still kind of paranoid, right? She always like waking up in these. Uh, just screaming and stuff out of these nightmares and what what do the humans call it a cold sweat or some shit like that waking up screaming or son tense or mom mom you okay michael myers is dead it's been 20 years mom you need to move the fuck on and then she's like look john that motherfucker's still out there and he's like no no he's not mom you gotta calm the fuck down you stressing me out and then she just be looking at her son like i don't know what it is with these young motherfuckers but they don't get it I guess they ain't seen the first two movies. Michael Myers ain't dead. Every time you think he dead, he's back again and he's stronger than he was before. On a scale from 1 to 10, 1 being horseshit on a hot, smelly-ass day, and 10 being mind-blowingly amazing, I'm going to give this movie an 8 out of 10. Pretty damn good. It's definitely better than Halloween, Curse of Michael Myers, Halloween 5 and 4 and 3. You know what I'm saying? I feel like I put it right after two in terms of it feeling like a Halloween film. It feels like a Halloween film. It's in a different setting, like how in the second one we were in a hospital and stuff. This time we're in a private school. And, you know, Lori, since she got a son, I'm like, yo, is Michael Myers going to stab his shit up, too? Because he technically family in a sense. And I was like, what's going to happen to L.O. Cool J's character, Ronnie? Because he's black. You know how black people, you know, are in horror movies. They usually get killed off, and it's because of the white character. So I was like, you know L.O. Cool J's character is going to be dead. But to my surprise, that nigga didn't die. I was like, oh, <laughs> breaking the horror stereotype, are we? But I really appreciate Laurie Strode. She's a great female character, okay? Jamie Lee Curtis. You deserve all the props. It's like this time around, Lori Strode ain't playing. She got her short hair. She's willing and ready to fight Michael Myers. She was calling him out and everything like, come out here, brother. Yeah, that's right. You've been chasing me around this whole fucking franchise. I'm the head mistress of a private school. OK, I got a weapon now. Step your ass out from the, sta uh, the from the shadows and let's fight it out. You said we family and shit. Let me kill your ass. Right. The sister killing the brother. Wouldn't that be poetic since you started this shit way back in the first movie in 1978? Come on, motherfucker, where you at? So Lori Strode, I just like how she's like, you know what? I'm, I'm tired of being scared. I'm tired of running. I got to put an end to this motherfucker right now. And as we know, she technically didn't because there's another film after this. But you know what I'm saying. But yeah, I really like this one. This one's a cool installment. Terrence out.